fixed debts. Let's have a discussion. I've got a client who is on $70,000 worth of income. They want to purchase a property with their partner and they have got 40 grand worth of hex debts. Obviously that is going to have a impact on their borrowing capacity to some degree. They have to pay back 2.5% of their income, which is the current repayment income threshold for 30th of June, 2025 financial year. They have to pay $1,750. If you do the maths, $40,000 of 1750 being paid back on a yearly basis. That's 22 years worth of paying back a hex debt. Where was that actually disclosed to these clients? Because they're probably sitting there not knowing what, oh yeah, you'll be right, get your hex debt going on. What is the biggest hex debts you've got? Obviously this is not the largest one I've seen in my career. Um, But obviously if you do not have generational wealth being transferred down or have got a high paying income to actually pay these things back in a rapid um, pace. You're potentially trapped in these um, loan facilities for a very long time. In this instance, $40,000 worth of a hex debt being paid back at $1,750. It's at least 23 years, potentially even more, because the interest is going on top of that 40 grand and it's going up on a yearly basis. Comment below, really interested to know, is this actually off-putting for you to go into uni to better yourself or have you gone into a TAFE or you've gone into an apprenticeship to completely bypass that hex debt, which can have a substantial burden moving forward. My name is Laura Moy, our local mortgage broker. Comment below, I want to know what's going on.